Well, hello and welcome out on a little day trip today. I'm here in Grants, New Mexico now at the famous Fun Pick area. Isn't that awesome? We are heading to a place called El Moro Monument. About an hour south of here. And uh, I don't know anything about it other than uh, looking it up online real quick. So let's go explore. Well, my GPS played a number on me. <laughs> I've never been this way, so I plugged it in my uh, GPS, and it had me turn off the road and go right through a small town called San Rafael. But other than wasting time, it was a pretty cool little place. Pretty interesting uh, little town. So, back on track, let's go. Now we're getting up into the mountains here, it looks like. Larger trees. A little cooler temperature. Pretty nice. Ah, we finally made it to the El Moro National Monument. A lot of winding in and out, up and down the mountain. But we finally made it. Let's go check it out. Okay, very nice uh, forest ranger in there. Told me about uh, a couple trails. Let's go see if we can find them. Let's go. Now this one's a nice little paved trail here. Nice and easy. Whew, the elevation is pretty high. I can feel it trying to breathe. <laughs> she said a lot of, uh, a couple of the trails are closed due to a bunch of snow and ice. Awesome cliffs there. Supposed to loop around it's about a half mile, so not too bad. It's supposed to be some uh, ancient water feature up here that I want to find. It's so cool to get up so close to these cliffs here. It may be only a half a mile around this trail, but it is quite steep. We're getting close to the cliff's edge. There's supposed to be some kind of names etched in here too. It is humongous. Once you get closer, wow.
so peaceful and the birds singing little rest area here oh here's the oasis Oh, now I'm going downhill. A little slippery with some sand on it. Wow. Now this is that water feature of that pond that the forest ranger was telling me about. She said it was 12 feet deep and this was the only water for miles and miles around. Very cool. I guess they don't want you jumping in there, swimming. It's a gorgeous area. Definitely worth the uh, trek all the way back here. Definitely. And it's, uh, it's a nice warm day today for being winter. Still a bunch of snow on the ground, but I could almost take off my jacket. Here's a good look at that sandstone. You can see where it can easily erode there. Straight up, straight up. Wow, look at that crevice up there. Oh, you have to break your neck to look up. Oh my gosh. Here's some names that have been etched in here. Some petroglyphs here. Look at all that just etching in there. The Spanish colonizers. kind of hard to see. This one here says 1866. Wow. Look at this crack in this rock here. Goes all the way up. I think that's going to fall over soon. I really do. Hopefully not while I'm walking by. That'd be a heck of a video, wouldn't it? Big G gets smashed. A million views. I think that's probably what it'll take. <laughs> now she did say this was closed around the corner here. Wow, there's a lot of prints here. Someone even carved a, uh, like a frame or a rope around that one. Wow. It's way up there. Eighty-nine. Wow. 1871. It is the most precious cliff historically possessed by any nation on earth. Well, let's check out another trail. On the way up here, it said trail closed. That sign right there. I'll go up here a little bit. 
Check it out. Now I knew I was gonna do some hiking. That's why I wore some old shoes. But I forgot about the elevation. It's a couple thousand higher than uh, Albuquerque. And uh, a lot of steep trails. <laughs> heck of a view. It's a heck of a picture right there. Looks like they're working on it here. Ooh, a little muddy. It's all right. A little steep. Whew. Oh, real steep up here. Walking right through the rocks. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Wow, look at that little cave up there. That's pretty cool. Whoo, we are up here at a high elevation. No wonder I'm breathing hard. And Got to climb those stairs. Oh. <laughs> oh, we made it to the top of the cliff. Oh my gosh. Pay no attention to the old breathing hard man. Oh, oh this is awesome. Check out this view. There's a cliff right here, so I don't want to go too far. Whew. Wow. Little uh, hoodoos, I think they're called hoodoos. It's very cool. Well, I'm going to go a little bit farther. I don't know how much farther. It's very uneven terrain. It's definitely worth coming this way, though. I feel like I'm on top of the top of the cliffs, which kind of am, but not the real tall ones. Oh, more steps. Well, I'm going to hit those steps. And whatever's at the top, time to turn around. And there's more steps. Ow! There goes the knee. Oh, come on. You can do it. Oh, we are really up here now. Whoa, lost my balance. More steps. Nope, not gonna do it. I can't, my heart's beating out of my chest. We're almost as high as those cliffs over there. Man, kind of pushed myself. Face is all red, out of breath. It's all right, gonna make it. It's worth it, it's just beautiful, it's so quiet. Okay, let's mosey on back and exit through the gift shop. One last shot of those incredible cliffs up there. Just can't get enough of them. They're so beautiful. Cool to get so close. Oh, it got warm. Sun's coming up and heating up walking. Had to take the old jacket off.
I'm back in Grants, and uh, it's a wonderful little town. There's a lot, a lot of things to see, but ooh, it's been a long day, and I think we're going to call it a day. I think that's going to do it, folks. Thank you so much for coming along. That's a long train. That is a long, long train. I've been standing here for I don't know how long. Still going by. But uh, time to head back east, back home, and take it easy. Take care of yourself. Bye now. Mm-hmm.